How y'all doing, them kids, Saints? It's Mel and Terrell tonight. Hello. And what we are doing is we're doing the review of the cream of crab soup. I left this, left it in the bowl that we heated it in so that you can see exactly like what it looked like. And I'm telling you all, that's an improvement because I added milk. They didn't exactly tell you what to add. They just called it a semi-condensed soup. And they say use half a can. And don't heat it to boiling. Just heat it. So we're about to try this. And uh, here's your bowl. And here's my, well. Well, let's try this. You want more than that? That's good. <laughs> you sure? Yeah, I might not like it. I'm gonna give me a good old, good old bowl. They got chunks of crab meat and everything in there. Mmm, delicious. Uh, well, you got the spoon? Yes. Hold up. Y'all have to excuse me. I'm double. I'm double recording. Um, hey y'all, me and Terrell about to try the cream of crab condensed soup. Okay, let's go. One, two, three. It's not bad as you would think. It's not my first choice that I would go to the store and pick up. But it's not bad as you 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 would think. Because I'm telling y'all, when we opened this can and we poured it out, it was great. It, it was not nothing you wanted to try if you just went from not adding anything to it. It's not that bad. It wouldn't be my go-to soup, though. <laughs> not me either. They actually got the nerve to have chunks of crab in there. You see that chunk of crab on my my spoon? Yep. I won't be getting this again. Please not. Well, I got it at the Dollar Tree. It's only a dollar. <laughs> This might be good if you used it in a dish, though. You know, with some pasta and some cheese. That might be good. Like a cream of mushroom. Now I got my mind racing. Now I think I'm going to go buy another can so we can try this something else. Some pasta or something like that. Hmm. Yeah, I think we're going to do that. So if I cook with this, you ain't going to eat it? But you eating it right there, so you will eat it. So I ain't got no choice. You have a choice. You can always eat noodles or some eggs or some or peanut butter and jelly. You ain't got to eat it. Yeah. I don't know. It's just something about it. It bites you in your neck. It tastes like a. Tastes like it. Tastes like crabs. Yeah, and it tastes like an imitation cream, um, clam, clam chowder. Yeah. Yeah, it tastes like a weak clam chowder with crabs. Well, y'all know me. I don't play around with the spoon. Mmm. When you drink it, the chunks of crab just fly in your mouth. And you're not expecting that. Well, you all say I'm done. You want more? Go for it.
Nah. I wouldn't make this my super choice. But, <clears throat> let's see. But, it's only 35 calories for a third of a cup. Three-fourths of a cup. So, I guess if you're on some kind of diet or something like that. It's the best for you. I think I prefer to eat tomato soup than that. I prefer to drink chicken broth than that. Look, you know, then they got a little. Then they didn't clean the crab really well. There's a little piece of the uh, filament of the crab in there. I don't know, y'all. It, if I had to eat something and I didn't have the money, uh, this would this, be all right. But I could get a, a thing this of noodles right? for the cost of that. Yeah, it would uh, be good with crackers. You think? Yep. Hmm. Plain? Yep. Ritz? Well, oh, like plain white crackers, like sardines and stuff. They would be good with crackers. What? If, if I was sick, and I if if I didn't have no choice to eat no they had no soup, I would get that. With some crackers. So sure, and I, what I was if I had my own place and then they had no way to um have no soup, that would be them. You go come time you go see like a thousand of those in my cabinet. Well, I got it at the Dollar Tree. Yep. Mm mm. No, oh, y'all, I don't like that too much. You can have the rest of that if you want. Got crackers? Uh, no, I don't believe so. But I think I'm going to save some of that for your mama to taste. No, oh, it's dope. <laughs> no, ma'am. No, you would like it, though, for real. The ma it tastes, no, no sir. It, it tastes like, tastes like, um, uh, well, you know, the, um, I guess that's clam, it. Chowder, this is it, it right here. Well, you probably can't see because of the gold can. But well, the silver can. Yeah. But it is, uh, I guess, Wire River semi-condensed cream of crab soup. It's not the best of, but in a pinch is a meal. So until next time, y'all, thanks for watching. And um, I'm not talking to you, Saints. Just chill. Um, thanks for watching. Until next time. I don't know. I'm trying to put out more for y'all. So, uh, until next time, I think my next video will be an introduction of my me. Because I have not formally done that on um, Mel Baby. Until next time, much love, appreciation. Thanks for being subs on my bed. My bed. I don't want to look at y'all as subs. I look at y'all as family. So, until next time, family, have a good one. And I'm out. Okay, Saints, I ended that video because I just wanted to do the review of the cream of condensed on Mel Baby. But I'm back with the $5 fill-up for today. Now, my $5 fill-up for today, move that right there. Move that too. My $5 fill-up for today, it was mostly sitting on the table, is... Uh, it's for my vegan people and salad lovers. Um, this bag here, which is three romaine hearts, was two forty eight. I got that two forty eight. I got an avocado, forty four cents. A tomato, fifty five cents. Um, I got a little onion. It was like thirty nine cents. I got a cucumber, which was uh, 44 cents. And I also have, I didn't have salad dressing. So I figure we'll just put a little lemon on there to kind of give us a salad dressing. Um, yeah, I know I got salad dressing in my fridge, but that was not the challenge. The challenge was uh, $5 to make complete meal. Um, so, I got the red onion, the tomato, the avocado, the cucumber, and a bag of lettuce. 
with the lemon. All of that came up to 4.58. And to tell you the truth, how much did I say that red onion was? Something like 38 cents. Well, it was 32 cents. So, that's more than one meal now. Even though you'll have to be real stingy with the avocado, it's still more, it's more <laughs> than one meal. Uh, matter of fact, when I make our salad, me and Keisha salad, I only use one of these romaine heart lettuce and not even half of the cucumber and not even half of the tomato and don't show not the whole onion. So I say the number of lettuce heads in here, you could probably make three good salads with all this. Mine is the avocado because that's going to be gone. <laughs> but other than that, you can make you good three good salads for under $5. And um, if you don't want lemon, try orange. What you doing that for? Orange on a salad? It's awesome. Never had it before. Um, I prefer mandarin slices, but orange as far as your salad dressing. Because if you see you don't you're not a salad eater like that. But this avocado, once you mash that up, it really creams really well. And if you put a few drops of liquid in it, it'll make you a dressing. So there it is, y'all. That's my five dollar fill up. Three three heads of lettuce. And I could have made this even cheaper if I used iceberg lettuce. But I'm not no real big fan of iceberg. Iceberg is normally, it normally runs 99 cents. So if I had to use the iceberg, I would shave like a dollar fifty off the cost of this. If you like iceberg, then hey, you you, you still got a whole another dollar fifty. You could buy a salad dressing. Yep. So there y'all go with your five dollar fill up. And um, this is Terrell, our oldest son. Y'all haven't seen much of him, but you will be, I guess. But he's like his brothers. They're not really camera people. <laughs> so, uh, till next time, much love, y'all. Thanks for being MK Saints. Thanks for being family. Um, wait, I had a few shout-outs that Keisha gave me because... Uh, what were they for? Is it somebody's birthday? You sure? Yeah, I'm talking to Keisha because she's not in the video, but she's right there. On Valentine's Day. It's the 13th. Oh, okay. Oh, no. Somebody's yeah. birthday on the 13th. Oh, the 13th. Okay, well, we could have did it early, though. We could do it on their birthday. I'm pretty sure they have Why are you talking if you don't want to get on the video? Thank you. I don't have the cuss draw because Mel won't be cussing because Keisha is semi out of the video tonight. So. Hi, guys. <laughs> thanks for watching, y'all. Thanks for being MK Saints. Hey, thanks for passing through and watching this. And until next time, we're going to push it down and pull you up. Push it down and dig you later. I know I ain't done a video for still. Well, then keep your mouth shut. <laughs> till next time. We're going to push it down and pull you up. And Much love, like, MK Saints. Oh, we don't, we, don't nah, talk to our, we don't talk to our family like that. Nah. You know, if they're going to yeah. like it, they're going to like it. If they're going to subscribe, they're going to subscribe. They gonna subscribe. Yeah, same thing We're not family. forcing nobody to do nothing over here. We're not putting your arm behind your back and be like, leave that comment. You better say something. We ain't like that over here. <coughs> want you to Excuse sit me. Sit back and enjoy so till next time, much love, much appreciation, and we're going to push it down and put you up. All right. Later. Oh, wrong mouse. <laughs> <laughs> wrong clicker, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>